is your Trinity County Neighborhood Forecast. Well, happy Monday to you all. I'm Chief Meteorologist Mike Kruger, and you know, we've got uh, the start of the work week here. It's going to be warm, especially as going to the next few days, but we've also got some gusty winds out there. It's going to elevate the fire danger, not as much for Trinity County, but you'll see in the surrounding areas, it is going to be a bit of a concern. So let's start off by taking a look at those temperatures for today. Yeah, I mean, we're getting pretty warm, 95 degrees for Weaverville, Hay Fork 94, and Lewiston about 93 degrees today. There's a look at the red flag warning. Now, I mean, again, it just kind of neighbors us right out towards western Siskiyou County, Del Norte, and even northeastern Humboldt County as well. But that doesn't mean we can just let our guards down because we don't have a red flag warning. Let's take a look at the winds and see what we've got going on. Now, the strongest winds do look to be in the valley and the surrounding foothills. That's pretty clear to see here. But you can see some gusty winds for some of those higher elevations and even a little gusty for some of us here in Trinity County as well. You start getting in the greens and yellows, that's upwards of 25, 30 miles per hour. So you combine the heat, you combine the low relative humidity, there is going to be some areas here in Trinity County that we certainly got to keep an eye on and be very careful, be very vigilant about not getting any new fires started. There you can see as we go into the noon hour, it does improve a little bit here. And then we go into five, six o'clock in the afternoon. Again, there's a little bit of improvement. And then as we go into tonight, it uh, looks like conditions overall are improving as well. But this red flag warning, by the way, that, ex that extends through 11 a.m. Tuesday morning. So again, we just need to be really careful here, I'd say over the next 24 hours or so. All right, so there's your Trinity County neighborhood forecast. Temperatures in the Highway 299 corridor, they are gonna be somewhere in the mid to even upper 90s. Could some of us touch 100 degrees? Uh, you know, I think it may be a bit of a stretch, but by tomorrow, I think maybe that'll be a different story, especially for places like Hay Fork. You go into Tuesday, Wednesday, temperatures do drop. We're back down to the upper 80s here by the time we do get into the weekend. So there is some relief in sight as we do look at the long range here, but it's still gonna be pretty warm out there. Temperatures, as mentioned, about 100 degrees here for Tuesday, Wednesday, and then where temperatures are slowly dropping after that down to the upper 80s to low 90s by Friday, Saturday, and Sunday.